My name is Jason Vong and today I'm gonna to show you how to hook up your Sony camera to your computer to be used as a webcam for live streaming. You will need a few items to get started. A camera with an HDMI output port with a tripod, a USB to HDMI capture card device, and a HDMI cable. So let's go ahead and dive into the specifics to ensure that you have all the right gear. Just about every Sony camera, including the Alpha and the RX series, have a micro HDMI output port. But just to be absolutely sure, I highly recommend looking up the camera model and finding out what size is the HDMI. It will be either full, mini, or micro. And believe it or not, there's a huge difference between a mini HDMI and a micro HDMI. I personally use the Alpha 7R Mark IV and the Alpha 7 Mark III and both use a micro HDMI connection. Next up, ensure that you're buying a USB to HDMI capture card device and not simply a USB to HDMI adapter. The capture card device is what allows the feed of your camera to be sent to your PC or Mac. There are several good options out there such as the Elgato Camlink 4K and the Aver Media Live Gamer Portable 2 Plus. Personally, I have the Elgato Camlink which is incredibly compact and small which helps when I want to live stream even when I'm out of town. Now just a quick heads up, if you're using a Mac with only Thunderbolt 3 connectivity, you will need to get a Thunderbolt 3 to USB 3 adapter in order for you to connect your capture card device. Lastly, the HDMI cable. The capture card device will likely take a full size HDMI, but on the other end of that cable has to match the size that your camera takes. In my case, I will need a full HDMI to micro HDMI cable for my A7R Mark IV and my Camlink. Simply connect them all together and any software that can recognize a camera connection will list your capture card device as an option to be used. This includes Skype, Slack, Zoom, and even Google Hangouts. You are now even ready to stream on Facebook Live and YouTube Live. Now, if you do see your camera menu items being displayed while you're connected to your computer, simply head to the menu, find HDMI settings, info display, and turn it off. This is what's known as a clean HDMI feed. Also, to ensure that you're in focus while you stream, enable face detection autofocus. Your camera should also be in movie mode and continuous autofocus should be enabled. If face detection is not showing up for whatever reason, simply find file format in the menu and change from 4K to HD. Definitely download open broadcast software, commonly known as OBS. And to use this software to stream to Facebook, YouTube, or even Twitch Live, simply copy the stream key from those platforms to OBS and start broadcast. And that's it. Hopefully this has helped you out and have fun on your live stream.